Welcome, sir. Um, Joseph Gonzalez, and I'm from Fresno, California. Um, Amen. What's on your heart, my brother? <laughs> Go ahead. Just let it be. Come on, people. We got to be silent. We, we, we could chill. What's on your heart? <laughs> so, right, take your time. Take your time. God brought you here. There's a purpose God brought you here. Because, you know, you're on the end of your rope. And God brought you here. <laughs> take your time. I ain't going nowhere. I can't see you anyway, so. <laughs> but I feel you. I feel your heart. So say what you want to say. Aside from Jesus, you have been my best friend like throughout this whole thing. Who's been your best friend? <laughs> what? Who's your best friend? John? <laughs> you are my best but friend. I'm your best friend? I don't even know you, but that's, I take it. <laughs> I take it, baby. Amen. I take it. In Jesus' name. Amen. In Jesus' name, I take it. Um, my question is, um, I am, was born into a family of three generations of witchcraft and um, like doing good. I'm, I'm out. I'm, I'm like from just from them, but it's hard because I have my mom and she's the only woman that I've loved. First woman I've loved mm -hmm. and it's hard to say goodbye, but she's like not even say goodbye because I still want her in my life, but she's just doesn't change no matter how much I try to help her. Where your mom live at? Um, Fresno. Okay, so you love on her. Um, That's what you have to do. Love on your mom. My mom would drop in there for eight years. I still loved her. And now she's Christian. Well, I loved her so much, she had to be a Christian. <laughs> <laughs> um, I moved out from, I live in this trade school now where it, it's um, just a bunch of people who earlier like, didn't finish high school, trying to find a trade, and there's a lot of drugs involved and stuff. So. I've left that place back at home. Now I'm in this place. Um, so I'm just finding it hard to um, just balance my faith here because um, I feel like I've bla I backslid. Um, oh, you backslid. Um, I was battling a homosexual spirit and then. I can um, see that on you already, but we're going <laughs> to break that today. No, no shame. You know, you know what? You know, no shame. You know what? I, I, the thing that dropped, you know, are you, are you dating somebody now? What was the last time you got involved with, it, with someone? Mm, like two years. Two years ago? What was the last time you got intimate with someone? Or what was the last time you got into with another person, another man? What, what was the last time? Um, it's not far. It's not too far. <laughs> Let's be honest. Holy Spirit's here. It's not too far. I don't want to say it, but I'm going to let you. I'm going to let you. About let you say. Two, early 2021. 2021? You got involved with someone, right? You got, so that person was a witch person. He knew witchcraft. You got involved with him, and we're going to break the things off you and put you back on the right track because God has an Esther for you. Are you married? No. Uh, what do you want? Uh, Let me see that ring. Let's open that ring. This is for my promise to Jesus Christ. But, okay. All right. Um, well, we're going to promise things deeper. We're going to break hindering, delay, and blockages in your life. You believe that? Yeah. Okay. So do you want to be married? You want a hottie in your yeah, life? I do. Yes. Right. And then you come up and we pray. All right. Amen? Thank you. And we'll put things in order. <laughs> you, know, you, know, you know what's crazy? Yeah, you can come over here. I don't bite. Come here. Let me, you know what's crazy? America is so screwed up. Listen to this. Look how screwed up America is. Look how screwed up. June is, June is prime month. Yeah? You with me? Prime month, June. The whole month of June, prime month. People suck lollipops. <laughs> the whole month of June. But then the, we have Memorial Day for one, only one day. We celebrate people that gave their lives for this country only one day. But then we celebrate prime month the whole month. They got a whole month. But then the veterans that bled and shed for this country, that some are crippled, some don't, don't even remember what hit them. We're going to celebrate them for one day. Think about it. But God's going to turn that around. You will see. God's going to turn that around. Amen? Yeah, my sister. Uh, name and where you're from, miss? Melissa, and I'm from Baldwin Park. 